prisoners, we almost always hear of political prisoners in other countries, as if there are no political prisoners in the US, but there are. There are many former Black Panthers and others in the Black Power Movement, Native Americans and, and others. And today we're going to talk about some of the work Nino has been doing organizing a, to free political prisoners in the United States. Thanks for joining us, Nino. Glad to be here. So can you just talk about the state of political prisoners in the United States? Well, currently, I think, as you said, uh, the United States has dozens of political prisoners that are, uh, they, they've been uh, incarcerated primarily because of their beliefs. They go against American capitalism, white supremacy, patriarchy, what have you. And they're, they're really uh, soldiers from a past era of movement, the Black Power Movement, uh, American Indian Movement, uh, Chicano Movement, uh, and so on and so forth. So today we have movements uh, like Jericho that are trying to rekindle the general movement and consciousness around political prisoners because uh, we still have to deal with the fact that uh, we have only 5% of the world's population, but 25% of the world's uh, incarcerated. And those who are incarcerated from the past uh, large social upheaval, we have just gems of knowledge, you know, uh, 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 important people to movements and communities just riding behind cages, all because they chose to uh, challenge American power, uh, capitalism, racism, uh, patriarchy, um, such as Mumia Abu Jamal, Leonard Peltier, uh, most recently Red Fawn. She was an indigenous woman who was uh, entrapped by the FBI during the uh, Standing Rock movement. Uh, so we have not only political prisoners uh, who are, you know, older elders, but we have new political prisoners uh, entering into the United States prison system uh, every year. Seek Mary Spio, a sister, she created these amazing headphones. Uh, I love them being black and gold. I know, Scott, it's all good. Uh, and again, they are uh, 360 degree sound headphones. Y'all should have a slideshow. Y'all should be rolling. Thank you very much. Uh, she created these Bluetooth. You can listen to them for gaming as well. Folks, the sound is amazing. Let me tell y'all something. I've got about 10 pair of headphones. I've got Bose. I've got a whole bunch of them. But this, these 4D 360 degree headphones are amazing. They've got a great, great uh, discount uh, for those of you who uh, support this show. Uh, you can use th this uh, code to get these headphones. Uh, they're phenomenal. Right there. All you got to do is go to seek.com, use the promo code RMVIP2020. RMVIP2020. In addition to that, folks, uh, she created this virtual reality headset. All right, so come back to me, guys. So this is real simple. Uh, if you go to seek.com or if you're looking at some 360-degree videos on YouTube, you simply place your phone right here into the headset. And then what you do is you just put the headset on just like this here. And so you can then watch these virtual reality videos uh, here as well, folks. I'm telling you, it's a whole different experience when you've watched uh, a VR video or 360-degree video because what happens is the way it's shot, you can literally look all around you, and that's the whole deal. In fact, uh, we're gonna next week. Hopefully, we're gonna have it uh, taken care of. I actually shot some 360 degree video right here in our studio, and so we're gonna upload it so you can be able to see literally this entire set. You can see the whole set. You can see what's on the side, what's on the behind. It's pretty great. So go to Seek.com and you can get this VR headset or and or you can get these headphones right here. Don't forget, use that promo code RMVIP2020. We support Black-owned businesses. This is a sister. She's a native of Ghana. She actually created these devices. She has that site, Seek.com, and so some great stuff there. So please, we want y'all to support uh, Mary Spio. 